Today, I wanna to share with you the best coaching business model for you to thrive. Hey, I'm Mark Nelson. I'm a former public school teacher, math teacher, turn coach, because that's what I've done all my life, because I was a coach. I just changed my platforms a little bit. So I wanna to talk to you about the best coaching business model. I get asked this all the time, what do you do? Well, to start out, there's actually three things you need to do. And the first step is you have to give free content with no expectation, expectations, free value, right? And you can do it different ways. You can write, you can do video, you can do audio, or you can do all three. Now, I first got started online. The big thing was to blog. So I was a blogger. Now, I'm going to tell you something. I'm a math teacher, so guess what? Writing isn't my cup of tea. But I still write to give out value for free. On social media, different places in my email list, I just give value. No expectations. I'm trying to teach people. So what happens, they start to build a know, like, and trust with you. Now, the second thing, after giving away free content is now what you want to do is you want to ask for something with some content. So what it could be is you could just ask for an email in return for some more value. Or you could sell something for a really low ticket, but you want to over deliver that value. So when they give you their email address, they know that they're learning from you. Again, building that know, like, and trust. And again, it's how do you want to communicate with the world? You can write, you can do video like this, or you can do audio, or you can do all three. And if you look at my site, marknelsononline.com, I do all three. And it's just because I started writing that I still incorporate writing because people do want something to put in front of them once in a while. But a lot of people would rather listen to videos. And then a lot of people just listen in their cars for their audio on a podcast. So I do all three. And what I'll do is I do a video like this one. I put the audio down or the conversation down. I'll, I'll write it down and put it into my blog with a link to the video, with a link to my podcast. So they can get all three if they want. Okay, so the first one's free content. No expectations. Right, so how can you serve them for free? And then what you do is give out content, give out value, and ask for a small commitment, an email address. Maybe $3, $4, $7 book, something small. That's all it is. But you always give away your best. And then the third one, you gotta think about, I'm not, I don't know what you do. But what can you offer your niche? What kind of coaching program can you offer? What can you give them? Can you give them a course for so much money? Can you give them a course plus training? Can you give them a group? See, in the coaching world, there's actually two ways to coach, I believe. One-on-one, one-on-one, -on -one, on -one, and then there's group. And I like them both. I think when you first start out, you need to start out one-on-one -on -one, because you learn how to coach. That's my opinion. Then what you do is you can go in group because you can leverage your time more. You can talk to more people and you can do a group in summits in um, five day trainings and whatnot or else once a week mastermind. Now I first started my coaching online with a mastermind and I learned a ton from the dude. And then I developed, I got a one-on-one -on -one coach and I learned to do more and more and more. So that's it. You get to choose, but the best coaching model, right, is give value away for free first. Build that no like, and trust up. Then you give more value, but you ask for a little bit of commitment. Email list. For an email address, you get this, $7 book. And then what can you offer to your niche for more value? It could be 197 for one call a week could be 297 for one call a week could be 1997 for a six month course whatever works for you so there you have it hey if you got value from this subscribe to this 
hit that little bell so you hear it all the time. If you're listening to me on my podcast, subscribe to it on iTunes or that you're where you're listening to this the best. If you see this on my blog, I'm glad you're there. You all take care. Bye.